Hi you all, um, I've been looking at some videos of people trying to conceive and people having babies and I decided to make my first video. This is my first one so still trying to get the hang of it and um, I just thought I'd give a little background on me and my husband and our story. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Anything about my family, anything pertaining to parenting, feel free to ask. I'm here to answer questions. Um, I want to start off. My name is Heather. I'm 25 years old. I've been with my husband, Lee, who's 42 years old, for almost five years at the end of June now. We've been married since November of 2008. And between us, he has three daughters from a previous marriage, and I have a son from a previous marriage. He has been in my son's life since my son was 11 months old. And he is a wonderful father for him, as well as his kids. And we are going on grandchild number five. That's right, I'm a 25-year-old grandmother. Um, I love my kids to death, and we are actively trying to conceive a baby together. We are on cycle three, day 19, with my ovulation, um, charted to occur on Friday. We did a lot of baby making last week so hopefully that will something will become of that um it's taken I don't know it's been like the longest three months of my life and it just seems everybody else is having babies and I'm not but when it happens I guess it will happen and I would just like to not have such a huge age gap between my next child and my son who is going to be six in July. Um, my husband seems to only want to pop out girls so I'm hoping I get my girl. If not, we are happy with whatever we are blessed with. Um, as far as charting goes, I haven't done temperatures or um, cervical changes, because at this point, I'm just trying to track my ovulation and see what becomes of that, because I don't want it to get to the point where my husband's already saying it's becoming more of a job, and I don't want it to be like that, so I'm just trying my best now to see what happens. Um, like I said, I'm 25. I was born with cerebral palsy. I have a mild form of it, which I didn't have, um, too difficult pregnancy with my son except for preeclampsia. But I had a very, very mild case of it, so, um, as long as... If everything goes right, it should be okay with as far as my CP is concerned. Um, I think this time it's harder because my son was conceived on the pill. And it was so easy the first time without even trying. And now that you're actually trying, it's a lot harder. Um... I will probably be posting some more videos throughout our journey of trying to conceive. My second child, his fourth. Um, hopefully everything goes well. And like I said, if you have any questions about me, Lee, our kids, or anything pertaining to babies, parental stuff, feel free to ask if you need any help trying to find baby stuff 
at very big discounts. I'm the one to go to. Ask me anything, I could probably find it. I'm a stay-at-home mom, so I really... My son's in school. So I'm pretty much free to do anything. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask. And I will update you later. And I'm out. Bye-bye.